Hi everyone and welcome back. We all know how important it is to maintain a regular physical exercise routine for overall health and to strengthen all our muscles. The same goes for our eyes. Our eyes are very important and delicate sense organs and they too require regular exercise. In this video, I'll be sharing with you some of the practices I do to strengthen, stretch and relax my eyes. Please note that all this information is just for informational purposes and should not be relied on for any diagnostic or treatment purposes and do not substitute any uh, professional medical treatment. Of course, anybody who has any major eye disorder or disease must consult an eye specialist before practicing any of these exercises. So first of all, what I like to do is to close my eyes gently and take a couple of deep breaths in and out and guide all the muscles around the eyes to relax. And that includes the forehead, the eyebrows, the temples, the jaw, the cheek, just consciously allowing all the muscles on the face and around the eyes to relax. And then I open my eyes nice and slowly. Nice. The next thing I like to do is just to use the tips of my fingers and this is just something very personal I like to do and to gently tap around the eye so I'm hardly putting any pressure at all it's just a very very gentle tap around the eyes just guiding all those muscles into a deeper relaxation and increase circulation here just to get ready for the exercises and once I've done that, I'm going to release the hands, open my eyes and get ready for cupping, cupping of the eyes and uh, gazing into darkness. So for that, I rub my palms for a few seconds and I really feel that warmth and that energy created in the skin of my palms. And then I'm gently going to place the center of my palms right on top of my eyes cupping the eyes. So I'm not putting any pressure at all on the eyes. And then I open my eyes and gaze into that darkness. And this just helps to relax all the internal and external muscles. And that warmth helps to bring in a little more circulation. And then I close my eyes and slowly release the hands and blink my eyes to open. And this, just this, is amazing because it relaxes the eyes uh, a lot. Next thing I do is blink with awareness. That's right, just blinking is a great way to refresh the eyes. And I've noticed this when I am on my phone or I'm working on my laptop, the rate of blinking decreases significantly. And this is very important for anybody who's working with anything that requires a lot of concentration and focus. Unknowingly, we blink much less. So um, it's very important to take some time uh, out whenever we're working to blink consciously because blinking is important um, to kind of cleanse and protect the eyes from any irritants and of course provide moisture for the eyes. And just give the eyes a little break from all the light. So the way I do this is that I blink quickly 20 times, take a break, and then blink again 20 times. So I'm going to start. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And take a break. And then I'm going to do that once again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And relax. And then I open my eyes whenever I'm ready. And now I'm ready for more exercises. So the next exercise I'm going to do is that I'm going to shift my gaze right to left a few times and then up to down and back up and down and then diagonally from corner to corner. 
So I do each exercise about five times, but just for the sake of this video, I'm going to demonstrate two rounds of each. So starting side to side, I'm going to keep my head nice and upright and I'm going to start by gazing all the way to my right side without moving my head and then slowly shift my gaze toward the center all the way to the left without straining and then come back to center and release and relax. So the way I like to do this also is to stretch out my arm and gaze and focus on the thumb. And this just helps me to get a point to focus on. So I do it this way. Slowly shifting my gaze as my finger moves, my hand moves to the right. And then slowly coming back to center. So it's important to take it really slow here without rushing. And then I just switch to the left hand and then do the same thing all the way to the left and slowly come back and blink whenever I need to really come back to center and then I'm going to release and relax good the next one is going to be gazing all the way up and down for that once again I keep my head nice and upright I'm going to start by gazing all the way up without moving my head and then draw that line through center all the way down and then come back to center so how it would look if I used my hand is this and it's okay if your head moves a little bit initially just takes a bit of practice and take it nice and slow no rush all the way down and come back to center and then blink your eyes good so we did side to side up and down now it's diagonal so I'm going to stretch out my arms I'm going to start by gazing at my right thumb so my eyes are all the way to the bottom right corner and then I'm going to trace that diagonal line toward the left thumb top left corner and then once again shift my gaze along this line toward my right thumb and come back to center release take a little break and I'm going to do that on the other side so this time I'm going to start with the left thumb and then shift my gaze along this diagonal line to the right thumb so sitting upright, head is relaxed, shoulders are relaxed. I'm going to look toward my left thumb. Slowly shifting my gaze along this line to look at my right thumb, upper right corner. And then slowly move along this diagonal line and look all the way to the left thumb. And I'm going to slowly come back to center and release. And even between these exercises, I like to just warm up my thumbs just to give them a little break. Cup my eyes and I'm ready for the next one. The next one is making circles with the eyes. Okay, so for that, I don't use my hands. So I'm going to start off by looking all the way up and making circles clockwise without moving my head that's two circles so now I'm going to reverse going all the way to the left down right top one more time left all the way down and right and to the top and then I come back to center and relax Great. The last one I'm going to show is shifting focus. That's really, really important as well to help our muscles to get used to shifting um, our focus. Now, the way I do this is I stretch out my arm and focus on the nail of my thumb for about three to five seconds. 
without straining my eyes, I'm just focusing on one point. Then, slowly and steadily, I'm going to move my hand close to my face toward the bridge of my nose. And I'm going to stop when my vision starts to become blurry. And then I'm going to extend the arm back to where it was, keeping my gaze on my thumb. Now from here, I'm going to shift my gaze to about 10 feet away from me. And I'm going to focus on that one point. And that for me is just the point on the wall in front of me. About three to five seconds there. And then I'm going to shift my focus back onto my thumb and repeat. So bringing the finger a little closer to the face and away. And I'm going to relax, release, and take a little break, maybe even cup my eyes <laughs> one more time, and release. Right. I hope that this was useful and interesting to you. Please do let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you have any practices you'd like to share about how you uh, strengthen and stretch your eye muscles. Um, please do share with anybody who could um, be interested in knowing these practices and do subscribe to my channel as well so that you get to see more of such videos. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.